guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video we are doing a review on a beauty sponge. It is by Stanzo Beauty Co. Uh, they sent me this beautiful sponge. Yes, I used it already. Um, I'll insert some photos of it, you know, in this area. <laughs> and uh, we got to test it out. It actually you might be surprised with what I have to say. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But anyways, you guys go check out the rest of this video and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, put that notification bell if, so you guys are notified on when I upload next. And that's pretty much it for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy this video and thank you again. Let's get into it. Oh my gosh, my face is so free. <laughs> Hi guys. Um, so yeah, as per the intro, we are doing we are doing this bad boy right here. Um, it is called Stands Out Beauty Co. Makeup Blending Sponge. And it says, this is a multifunctional blending tool designed to apply a streak-free airbrush finish to your complexion. I am really excited to try this out and let you guys know because we are just doing our face and then I will like cut it and then I'll just do my makeup as normal. So Stands Out Beauty Sponge is $20. I believe this is an American product. So let's get into this video. Let's get into this how-to. I'm gonna show you up close. And so this thing comes out like this. And then there she is. It honestly, like at looking at it, I'm gonna be real honest, looking at it, you're kind of like, why is this all kind of weird looking? It looks like a diamond. And then you're like, there's so many edges and it's like super squishy, like it's like one of those kind of thing. But we're gonna wet this and we are going to um, start using it. So I wet it, so it's, can you hear that? <laughs> so I wet it and now I'm just gonna basically do my face uh, as normal. So I usually go with the Hydro Grip Milk Primer and I'm just gonna prime my face first. So we're gonna take this sponge I'm one of those people that doesn't put it on a dish. I usually put the sponge on itself. So I'm gonna use this uh, flat kind of surface and do all my face. I'm a little nervous, not gonna lie. I am using Fenty, of course, and I'm a little bit of a nude beige in matte and poreless from Maybelline. So I'm just gonna take a little bit here. So usually that much. And then I, I mix it and then I'll do like two pumps. So there's my foundation. Let's get it rocking and a rolling. It feels super weird, like not in a bad way. I feel like it's very, it definitely blending. Like I didn't think, like I'm doing a padding motion. I'm trying not to swipe so much, like, you know, as you can see. Wow. It blended really nice. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, that like went on really well and it blended really nice. It honestly was pretty like similar to a beauty beauty like the beauty blender sponge. I just think it I think for me it's like holding it because it's like it's kind of different. So I'm holding it like this. But we are gonna try, I guess, to use this corner for underneath the eye, or maybe go here underneath the eye. I'm gonna probably use this kind of area. I'm gonna go in with my Maybelline Fit Me and then just a little bit of my shape tape. It's very light, like it's very... I, I think it worked great. Like I don't see any flaws in it. I don't see any, I'm just gonna set my under eye. I wonder if you could use the sponge to set. Cause you know some beauty blenders you can. All right, this is another test. Oh yeah, 
that worked. Well, it didn't take it off. It put it on. So good. It blended like, I don't see any spots. All right. Well, that's the beauty sponge for you guys. I'm just going to finish my face for you guys and then we'll come back and we'll see how it works with blending and everything like that. So we'll be right back. So that is the finished look, you guys. It's nothing too crazy. I am wearing uh, my lashes on. I put them on for today. But as you guys can see, my skin is honestly on a point. Like, I don't know, I really do like this. And again, it worked with powder under the eye. Like, I just think you can actually, which, which is really cool with this, is like you can actually like morph it into like where you want it. Yeah, it like really does really well. It's, it's awesome wet. Um, and it blended really nice. It's really cool. Um, it's a good decent size is what I'd say. I don't think there's anything really wrong with it. It's just really unique and uh, make sure you guys go check out Stands Out Beauty to get your own. It's $20. Um, and let me know what you guys think in the comments down below if you guys are going to try this out. And that's just the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much to Stands Out Beauty uh, for sending this for me to review for you. I am beyond thankful. I can't wait to put this into my new makeup routine. And uh, like I said, I will leave everything linked down below where you can get it, where you can find it. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And thank you guys so much again for watching. I love you guys so, so much. Mwah. See you guys in the next video.